similar to extruded uh, cut, you also have something called revolved cut. It uses the same principle as a, a revolved bosom base, but we will just cut away a portion from uh, any design that we want. Okay. For example, let's say we want to do a simple sketch on top of this surface. So I'm going to select it, right click on it, and we'll select this option called sketch. Okay. And I've selected, let's say, to, to create this, something like this, a rectangle here, okay? But I want to cut away the portion using a revolved cut. So let's go into the features. We will select this option called revolved cut, okay? As you see, I, I, as I haven't created um, an axis line, it couldn't identify where the axis line is. So, I'm just going to select whichever I want to use as an axis. If I use this one, it will cut away in this portion. If I select this one, it will cut away in this portion. And it will do the revolve cut in this portion. Okay. So let's say we are going to select this one. Okay. Now, this is the portion it will cut away from the whole section. Then let's say you decide on by the way, as you can see this direction arrow, that means it's, it's revolving like this, okay, the clockwise direction. So let's make it 270. And as you can see, it has created the cut on this 270. But if you want to do it the other way around, okay, what you want to do is select this button called reserve, I mean reverse, and it will cut away on the other direction. Okay, so the way you want, you can just select it or if you can also do a directional tool or thin features. Okay, so as you have done, we can just cut away any of the portions, list, rest of the properties on the property manager is similar to extruded uh, cut. Just click OK and you will see that portion from the original object has been cut away in a, using the revolve pause and base object. Okay.